everyone, this is Libby from One Hall team. Today we are going to talk about how to level the One Hall i3 Plus printing bed. First, you have got a full assembled i3 Plus. We have videos to show how to assemble it. You could check on YouTube. Then we may use a small tool like a piece of name card or a piece of A4 paper. You will know what it's for. Then. You should connect all the cable of the i3 plus A to A. B to B. For this line, one to one side to the extruder. One, the other side to the electrical housing box. Then insert the SD card slot. To this one. It's on the right side of the machine. Then connect the, all the cable ready. Then connect to the power cable. Turn on the machine. And you could see there are one whole logo on the LCD screen. There are two ways to, con to leveling the heating bed. Now first today we will talk about the first one. So let's see the first way to adjust it by manual. So firstly print the system on the LCD screen. Home on all the X, Y, Z axis. So when it stopped, print the back menu and turn off the screen. Use your name card to adjust the gap between the extruder and the printing bed. When it is too close, just fasten the screen on the printing bed, then make it about 0 0.1 micrometer. Then move the extruder to the other side. Use your name card to adjust the gap between the extruder and the printing bed. Do not make it too fasten or too loose or you will get a failed printing model. Move the name card easily, then you will get a good one. Then move the printing bed to the side. You could see the gap is too fastened. Then adjust the screen this way. Okay, next step, the last corner. After finish the four corner, you could turn the printer on. Next, let's insert the filaments. So, print the two button. Move to light up the Z axis about three centimeter. 
back to preheat, choose PLA. And you could see the temperature is increased. Please wait until the temperature is go to the needed one. Okay, you could see here the temperature is ready and hold your filament. So there is a button on the extruder and insert your filament. And you could see some filament go out from the extruder there. Just hold the filament for some Second. Now your printer is ready to print. And go back to back again. Print. There is one model in the SD card. Wait for some seconds. Blah. Extruder temperature is ready. Then the printer will work. Maybe about one minute. Clean the filament for the extruder. Okay, it's ready. Okay, your printer now is working and maybe about one and a half hour later you will get a first your first model like this one by one hole and three plus. This is the first way to leveling the printing bed and the next we are going to talk the second one. So let's talk about the second way. Turn on the printer. The I the I three plus have one function level. So maybe you think it is the automatically but not. It's a semi-automatic. You still need to adjust the gap by manually. Then just the first corner of the extruder and the printing bed. So it's okay. Print the next button. The extruder will move to the other side. Adjust the gap, you can see a name card. Next, move to the right corner. Next. Okay, then next. So even you use this function, you still need to adjust the gap. And the next. This is the last corner. You're going to see the gap here. Perfect. And you could say now finish print the OK here.
So you can see the extruder lift up automatically and uh, preheat the PLA element. Also insert as the first way. Button here and insert your filament. The filament go out from the extruder. You can see here. Hold on for 30 seconds. Go out smoothly. Back and the back print G code. Before printing, clean the filament testing filaments from the extruder to get a new clean model. Now start it. Okay, waiting to get your first uh, testing model. If you have any questions, please visit our website as the below shows. Thank you for watching.